They are sent on their way from the 1400 meter marker. And Chap Trap is one of the first out of the gate, yellow sleeves and cap. Marin's trying to overcome the draw between the two of them, Roy's Mambo. Friend Request has scored three deep in the early stages, with the black cap has called wide out as Friend Request and being niggled at. Along the inside, Marshall that. Further back in the running, near the rail there, we find Rockefeller on the outside, Track King. The Stag King is on the outside, trying to get in. They're followed by Starsky, so now Actors further back in the run. The others are way back. And it's Marin who's now won the battle for the lead by two. Chap traps in the yellow back in second as they move towards the 800. On the outside, Friend Request has been caught wide out. They're followed by Roy's Mumbo. Rockefeller's got the red sleeves, then the Star King. Further back in the field at this stage, there's Marshall that. As they turn into the home stretch now, and Marin is the leader, Chap Trap. Friend Request is on the outside. Between the two of them is Marshall that. Friend Request has come under pressure. Coming to the 200, Marin the leader. Chap traps on the inside. Marshall that friend request. Down the inside, Rockefeller. Rockefeller tries to squeeze through at the rail. Marshall that and Chap Trap. Coming to the last hundred, anybody's race. Chap Trap's fighting right back at Rockefeller, but Rockefeller won a Chap Trap second. Marshall that third. Number seven, Rockefeller, the philanthropist, Charles Laird, Fire Racing Trust. Alesh Naidu, Marcus and Ingrid Yurster will just win it. Number seven, 570 the win, 220 the plays. Second, number one, Chap Trap. Third, number four, Marshall That. I said that went down very well, it pays 560 a plays. Fourth, perhaps, Marin, the Star King. Further back in the running then was Roy Giovanni, and then further back in the field, my word, my bond, my free, uh, the favourite, friend request, well it was caught wide in the early stages and hit the front or tried to challenge for the lead too early on, had absolutely nothing to come. The winner's on the left with the red sleeves and cap. Rockefeller sneaks through, chap traps in the yellow, trying to fight on, Marin, Marshall that, They're getting down to the line, Rockefeller nearest the rail, they get close together, but Rockefeller number one, or rather number seven, Rockefeller at 570, 220, just makes it home, chap trap was playing 21 round a win and 440 a plays. Until the running of the second race, which will start off our bipod, 10 race program, back to the studio. Nice uh, start for trainer Charles Ledier, number seven, Rockefeller, the son of philanthropist, and of course, bred by Clava Flay Stud. Well done to Alias Naidu and the Eustas here, Anton Marcus on the board early on Daily News race day. Uh, Charlie not on hand, but Anton is uh, definitely coming back. But first up, let's have uh, uh, owner Alias Naidu. Alias, come through. Yeah, you know, Charlie told me yesterday that the source is not, not fully tuned up and he may need the run, so he's just come through on pure ability, I guess. No, definitely. Uh, Charlie said uh, the source can run, but we definitely need a run. And uh, we didn't want to push him, so we said, and he needs further. So we said, let's run him, and from this run, we'll bring, he'll come on. And I want to say well done to Anton Marcus, to both right. Thanks to Charles Lair, he's done well at home, and this is for him. And of course, uh, you're in partnership with the source of the Eustace. Well, that's the magic. If you got the Eustace, there you got the magic. So, well, I'm well, a partner, Marcus Eustace, and also to Derek Brookman. Alice, moving away from racing, uh, the guys that don't know you've had, you've got 10 uh, comrades under your belt. You've got the green number. You running tomorrow? Yeah, all cross fingers, everything goes well, and I'm hoping for a good run. And I want to say this, firstly, for my wife stops around the comrades uh, tomorrow. And I made a bugger up with the comrades. I didn't set the time in, and she cannot run now. And I want to say, I'm doing the comrades, and this is for her. Okay, well done, Alesh. And we wish you all the best tomorrow. It's, it's Peter Maris book to Durban, isn't it? That's correct. So we, when do you go down? Uh, I'll leave at uh, 3 o'clock morning, and I'll be there for the start. Well, we wish you all the best, and uh, well done with this win as well. Sure, thank you very much. Well done to Alesh Naidu. And Alesh, before you leave us, come through. Uh, that is uh, the Daily News race day. You've got a three-month subscription as well. Sure, thank you very much. Well, Anton, come through. Before we have a, a chat about the win, uh, you know, let's talk about the, the track. It's a big day today, and how's things out there? Yeah, geez, the course, uh, I can't say it's an ideal surface for Group 1s. It's pretty packed here, the turn. Um, I think there's a fair amount of water on it. How much they've put on, I mean, I don't know. But it's, uh, it's not in great condition, these. 
Okay, that's for the authorities to take note of. But coming back to, to your horse, you know, Charlie and I spoke yesterday and he thought this horse would definitely need the run. Yes, it is. Yeah, it, was, it was a pleasant surprise, you know. But as you know, we, you know, we come out, we try every race, irrespective of the price. Um, yeah, his work at home suggested that he would need it. You can see he played up quite badly pre-race, got left out the gates. Um, so all things taken into account, I, I would say it was a fair Wendy's. Even though the last 200 metres or so, you still had to get him through that gap which was quite tight on that inside running rate, so he's got heart. Yeah, look, it's testament to his courage, you know. I mean, it's only his first time at the course. A lot of horses would spit the dummy, but uh, he put his in there and uh, he did it for me. Well, Anton, you've had a, a wonderful season when it comes to the big race days. Well done with that. It's another big race day here in KZN today. It's Daily News Day. What's your thoughts on your rides? These, um, I think I, I spoke to Joey about his filly before the race. You know, she's, she's probably, I, I would say, on form at best, in my opinion. She, she's good for possibly fourth at best. Look, stranger things have happened in races. You know, I mean, I'd love to be here talking to you, you know, post-race in the winner's box. But, you know, I believe that, uh, you know, at best you can run fourth on form. And, uh, you know, Robota, Robota he's, he's extremely well. He's, I'm very happy with him. Um, he, he probably will get the 10. Whether he's as effective, only the race will tell these. Thanks for that, Anton. And um, all the best for the rest of the afternoon as well. Thank you, Dees. Well done, Anton Marcus, Charles Laird. Well done to the entire team. Race number one, seven, one, four, and three. That's the way they cross the line. Coming up next, the start of the exotics, race number two, which will be the first leg of the bypot at 14.40, and that's 22.3.